What's up guys, it's the only Ninja Wong, Aviator Zane, the Superhero Hat, bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel. And if you want to learn the combination that you saw at the beginning of this video, this is the mini-series for you. I'm doing multiple episodes going over each segment, and today we have the final segment of the trick. The tricking segment, if you will. We're gonna start where we left off with our 10th strike and the combination on our on our side right here so what we're gonna do is we're going to open up with both hands just like this facing the opposite direction notice that I shifted my weight to the other direction so once once we're here we're gonna do our neck roll and I've done tutorials on neck roll in particular but I can break down each of these tricks more if you need just let me know down in the comments we're gonna do our neck roll coming around with our right hand and grabbing it with our left. Now, going nice and slow, it's basically just letting it roll and grabbing with the other hand. When you go faster, it keeps it nice and smooth, keeping it with a smooth pace over a fast, as fast as you can pace. You're trying to go for as smooth as you can. Now, from here, you should have it in your left hand towards one end. You're going to spin it out away from your body and you're going to flick it in with your wrist so it rotates kind of like a helicopter blade it's going to come around and rotate and you're going to catch the opposite side of the bow staff with your right hand so all together it'll look like that one more time so once you catch it with your right hand finish the spin all the way to your hip because this is going to be your wind up for your last trick the last trick is going to come out in front of you behind your head in front again and behind your back underneath your arm or right by your hip not underneath your armpit but by your hip just like this now with your left hand you're going to prepare it by putting it also by your hip just like this so it can roll onto the back of your hand just like you see right here goal is for the wind up to end up on the back of your hand once it hits the back of your hand all you're going to do is if you've seen karate kid the uh the painting the fence move going up and that's all you're gonna do with the bow staff to knock it up in the air and let it spin a couple times before you catch it on the way down now obviously it's hard to do in slow motion because it's a trick where you toss it in the air so I'm gonna show you a couple times so that hopefully you can kind of get the idea And now we should have the whole combination looking something like this. Starting with our spin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Adjust around the neck. Helicopter toss. And our finish. But all the way through, it'll be a lot cleaner and a lot smoother when I go full speed. So it'll look something like this. And there you have it, a full three-part tutorial on the tricking combination. If you've seen me do any other tricks that you would like me to break down, let me know down in the comments. And if you don't want to miss any more videos that I put out, make sure you hit the like, subscribe button, and hit the bell so you never miss a single episode that I put out. And also, you can check out the playlist of all the different tutorials I've made so you can catch up on some of the other things that I've gone over on this channel. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore. This is The Modern Ninja. And I'm out.